they go doing me now? I'm still a talk of the town. Don't need assistance, I'm hooking them down. We turn the spots in the frowns. You can't hop out, then we clearing the crowd. It's Eddie Will. We were House of Hoops right now. We at the Dykeman Basketball Court. Hey, hey guys, we're on a new episode of Talk of the Town. Today we have a special guest. Zeddy Will. What what should we call you? Are you like an actor, comedian, I'm a lot, I'm content like, creator? Like what are you? I'm like comedy, entertainer, all that. Like you a comedian, entertainer. I'm about to start rapping, so you might call me a rapper and oh all that. Oh god, you about to start rapping? It's about rapping? to get bad. I ain't gonna lie. But yeah, all that, all that stuff. Damn, you about to start rapping? Yeah, fake. Now on a like on some funny shit though, like on I'm some a parody shit. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Like for me, but just bringing you, comedy to rap and all that. That's what I'm gonna do. They used to do them skits and like parody music videos, but yeah. I ain't seen that in a minute. On YouTube and all that. Yeah, I ain't but seen nah. that in a minute. Yeah, I'm about to bring that shit back. I got you. So, where you from for the people that don't know? I'm from Queensbridge. So, I'm from Queens, Queens, New York. I thought yeah. you was from the Bronx or something. Nah, everybody think I'm from Glock Live from the Bronx. <laughs> nah, I'm from Queens. I'm really from Queens, Queensbridge. That's where I'm from. You're from the house. civilized part of New York. Nah, it's not. Some mine. Yeah, something like that. But something yeah, like that. Queens, the good parts, bro, but I ain't. It's. It's not Get bad. Nasty. I like it gets nasty yeah, everywhere in New York. Do. But um, so what was you into growing up? Did you always know you was gonna be funny, or was it like nah, like I wasn't even was into, into the internet stuff, none of that. Like I was just I did sports for me, so I ran track, played basketball, football till I got knocked out. Like I did a whole bunch of stuff. So football till I got, I got knocked, knocked out, out. hit crazy. mad hard, stop playing football, <laughs> swimming. I used to swim. I used to play lacrosse. I used to. So you were just trying to see soccer. what sport you was yeah, liking. Yeah, I was trying to just do every sport, like just to stay out and just keep doing stuff and not be in the streets. And so did you have a favorite sport? Track, track my my long lasting sport. Like I still run track to this day. Yeah, I seen you like be posting it sometimes. Yeah, I still be running track and all that, just going out for runs and all that. But yeah, nah, I wish I would have played basketball though. If I played basketball, I don't think none of this would be going on right now. You was nice I, and ball. I was, I was, I ain't gonna lie, I was fake nice. I'm just tall. I'm 6'2", six 6'3", six so. Okay. I could, I mean, I could still So you could do out. your thing and stuff like that? Exactly. Um, so like, how did, so how did it officially start for you? So all this comedy stuff started. Because I remember the videos out the window. Yeah, so those started <laughs> like, so everything started for me like quarantine time, like, like in the beginning of quarantine, nothing to do. I was like, yo, I'm going to hop on TikTok. But it wasn't my idea. Like, I wasn't really too fond of TikTok. I wasn't jacking TikTok. Like, I okay. was just on Snapchat. I used to be on Snapchat making videos, like, just like. And they used to be, like, putting on TikTok? They, exactly. And okay. I used to be like, nah, I'm not jacking it. That's for the dancers and all that. So <laughs> I put my first video Everybody on TikTok. Everybody be jacking TikTok, hey, when they first. Everybody, before they, exactly. Before until they, they get, get on, on there, then they talk about, I'm going to make a bag. Or I'm trying to get TikTok famous, all that. But, yeah, I threw one video up, and then I hit a mill. And then after that. It took over. Yeah. So you went from the point of, well, you went from the outside the window yeah. to the point of view videos. Right. So do you feel like you have a thing now or you kind of like just go with the flow? I think or? I just go with the flow. Like, I mean, obviously my biggest thing was like C-Bands, uh -huh. like that character I made, but I just flowed. Like I just was doing whatever. And I feel like it just gradually started to find something and then boom, one thing popped off. And then I still like now I feel like I'm able to do really whatever like. Uh -huh. I'm trying to keep my shit open Like I could do whatever I want Type right. shit So How would you explain C-Bands If someone never saw him I right, so I'm look, sure y'all seen him But you know Alright so look <laughs> C-Bands look, look, C For me is a character It's a character from New York And he's just wild Like <laughs> He's just He's just wild You see the vein Neck vein All that Like He's just a wild nigga from New York That just Just be screaming And and just going crazy. Like, it's just another mode I tap into. You got Zeddy, then you got C Benz. That's how I think about it. Okay, so is C, you think C Benz your alter ego, or he's like your alter ego exaggerated? Or what do you I think? I think. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. I'm jacking alter ego, but just exaggerated. Because he, like, C Benz be wild. Like, <laughs> like, you know, you got Martin, and then you got. Fucking, uh, what's the, the, uh, the girl? I forgot. Uh, what's, what's it? Shanique? Shanane. Shanane. Like then you got you got a whole bunch of I mean a whole bunch of people so that's how I eventually want my shit to get like a whole bunch of different characters. So Okay. All right. So when was that moment I guess you knew you was funny? Was people telling you? Was your mom's telling you? Yeah, nah, people used to always people tell me. People put you on the spot, like, yo, make us laugh. Like, nah, how was that? People used to always be like, Oh, you funny, or they just start laughing, like I used to do a lot of dumb stuff, so I ain't never always think I was funny, like still to this day, people be like, Are you mad funny? 
And I'd be like, <laughs> facts. Like, I'm, I'm okay. funny, but, yeah. Everybody think I'm funny. So what was that, like, first viral moment for you? Uh, I think it was that first video I posted on TikTok. And then it was, like, a point of view video, some shit on Instagram Live, and that shit a million in, like, five days. Mm -hmm. And that was, I was like, oh, that was OD to me. <laughs> like, a mil now is not as crazy as it was before. Like, I was okay. like, damn. So that was the first time I'm like, damn. During quarantine, facts. Yeah, it was the, boy, and I was, everybody was jacking me, sending me my video, all that. Yeah, that was, those them times, I ain't gonna lie. So, um, so do you feel like, people always try to make it seem like it's a strategy to go on viral or you just gotta know Yo, what to do, what to bro, say, how to. It's no, it's no strategy. Like, I, I was dead one of those though. I used to be like, oh. Maybe if I post that 907, my <laughs> shit might go viral. <laughs> oh, I hit a I I post a video at 907, it hit a million. Nigga, every day I post at 907. <laughs> I don't care if I'm at the dinner table. I'm 907. 907. It's no strategy. It's really just like being consistent. Yeah, just being and consistent being and, and building creative. a fan base and all that other stuff. That's really all it is. All right. So do you have like comedians, I guess, that you look up to or that like OG. with some inspiring? Like who? I think my my biggest is Marlon Lawrence. Like I said, like Mm -hmm. I got the idea of having a different characters from him. So okay. Marlon Lawrence is my favorite comedian. I hope to meet him one day. But other than that, and then Jim Carrey, that's really? everybody, everybody be lost when I be saying that. That's because of the faces. Like, he be making yeah. like faces and shit. <laughs> uh, yeah, I be doing all that because of him. So those are my two favorite comedians. So would you get into acting? Are you planning to? Or you got Absolutely. something in the works? Yeah, yeah. I'm working on Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. okay. A little show. A little HBO. A little shit. A little something, something. Okay. Yeah. Name already? Special guest? On the, uh, on the, on the. On the, yeah. Just yeah. know, I ain't gonna lie, I'm gonna post it on the gram. Y'all gonna see it. And then it's gonna be active. But it's definitely in the works, though. I'm just okay. trying to learn how to read scripts and shit. Because, you know, I don't do that. Like, for my videos, I'm right, just. So you be freestyling? Yeah, I be, yeah, really be freestyling. Like, I'll write an idea down. Like, on my notes, I got mad ideas. Okay. And, like, my brother and my cousin, like, they'll record me. But it's just, I write an idea down, and I'm gonna do the vid. Like, can okay. you record me real quick? That's really how I go. <laughs> Really don't all situations. Okay. Do you like be having to do videos over and over? Od. Do you feel like that loses the funny in the video if you keep nah, doing it over? I feel like it builds it for me. Like for me, I'll know. Like if I do three takes on a video, and I'll be like, Nah, I gotta add something. I wanna add this. It just give me more time to add something into the video, cause I'll be trying to perfect every video. Like, and that's what people don't really be liking. Like, I'll be feeling bad for the niggas recording me, cause you gotta record me make <laughs> mad takes. Okay. But at the end of the day, that should be working out for me. So mm -hmm. I'm just, if it ain't broke, I ain't going to fix it. So whoever's the cameraman that day got to know. Huh? Whoever's the cameraman that day got to know. Yeah, yeah, like yeah. It's cameraman, gonna be yeah. Cameraman, no. They know who they are. They <laughs> just, you got to be patient because my shit, go, it got to blow up. They got to blow up. Okay. Was there ever a joke that you received bad feedback from? A joke that um, cause remember when Drewski did that joke yeah, when he was drinking? His, yeah, they took it down. He tried to take yeah, it down. Yeah, but it was showing a point of view. He was not saying he do that, but like I think you ever did a joke that recepted differently than you thought? Nah, I feel like nah, cause I do be paying attention. Like uh -huh. when other people be posting videos, and I be like, nah, that's wow. So I'll go in the comments and see what they saying. But mm -hmm. I feel like comedy, comedy, bro. Like if you don't mean it in a certain way. Like, we comedians, so I feel like this should be fun. Everything is funny. Like, Do you feel like the point of view videos get tricky depending on who's watching? Or Yeah. Like, I did. I remember doing one video, and it was about, like, uh, it was Spanish people. <laughs> it was some Spanish people, some. And I started to note. I don't really read comments a lot, but I just wanted to see what they were saying because it was a lot more comments than usual. Right. So they saying, oh, this is, this is racist. racist. This is not. You shouldn't be posting this. But then those are, like, five or six of the comments. The rest is... Oh, I'm Mexican, and this is funny to me. I love to see shit like that, because it's like, okay. Was they jack, if they jacking the vid, So, do you read your comments? I do sometimes. I read them sometimes. Do you think it's a good thing or a bad thing? Um, I think it's a good thing. I mean, it, it's a good thing and a bad thing. It, it depends on the person, I feel like. For me, I mean, I'll, I'll read my comments, and they be saying negative stuff or positive stuff. It don't matter to me. I just, it's feedback. Sometimes somebody will tell you, Yo, you should look, your hairline look crazy in this vid. Or another <laughs> video, they'd be like, uh, I feel like, like fans don't be knowing what they want at the same yeah, time. Fan, but at that point, like. They come and go. Yeah, yeah. It's like so supporters it's like, and fans and all that other stuff. They going to just comment on the video. It's like, that's what just, that's what builds everything. I feel like you commenting is going to make the video blow up anyway. Do you um have a name for like your supporters or fans? Nah, I mean, I, one thing I 
started doing, I just call them supporters. I just, I don't know, to be calling people fans right now, mm-hmm. early, this, in the, early in this um, part of my career is like, I know what fans are. Like, I got some fans, but those are the ones that be trying to find my address. <laughs> that, like, those are the ones that text what? me every day. Like, I know some fans, like, that text me every single day, try to find my address, will pop up to every meet and greet I got. Like, I know those select few, but... I call everybody supporters because you just support me. So man. what's the craziest fan interaction we done, you done had? Trying oh. to find your address is crazy. Yeah, so <laughs> oh, craziest fan interaction. I think I think they're going to know. The, uh, we was at Brooklyn Bridge Park for a takeover. We had like a big basketball game. Mm-hmm. And there was a fan that he just was texting me all week before come, like before the thing. Like, yo, I'm going to be there. I want to take a picture. I want to meet you. I want to hug. All that. So I'm okay. like, I got to look. he young? He was young. They be okay. like 12, 13. Like, oh, okay. So I was like, all right. He just, I mean, I be, I be reading my, my messages and all that too, my DMs. So I just went on his profile. I wanted to look at what he looked like. So if I happen to run into him, I'll see him. Right. But I got, it was a rude awakening because that little nigga was just fiending, just grabbing me the whole time, <laughs> grabbing on my shirt. I threw my shoe. He the one that found the shoe. Like, he, um... He was like, oh, I tried to follow you home, but it was too much traffic. He texted me after the games and all that. <laughs> like, that was the oh, craziest wow. one. That's when I knew, like, oh, nah, these people really, like, they really love me. I they, tried like, they really to fuck follow with you. you home. I tried to follow you home, but it was too much, much traffic. traffic. Who was driving the car? <laughs> what you mean? Like, who was in an Uber? Like, he's 12. He's day young, but that was, that was when I was like, damn, that shit get real. Shit get real. Okay, so that's, of course... So, so in those situations, like, how do you handle it? Are you getting better handling those situations? Um, yeah, no, nah, nah, like, just, are you turned off from fans? Like, nah, I just be, I just be like, the fans, are like, the, like the supporters and stuff, they funny. Like, they funny. Like, I feel like the more I be talking to them and, and showing them that I'm just a normal person, just like them, mm-hmm. they'll spread that message to people, and you'll grow a bigger fan base like right. oh he regular like he cool he be talking to everybody like mm-hmm. and then they'll spread that and then that's why i be getting like if i text somebody back if i dm somebody fan right now and i i say thank you for your appreciate like thank you for your support <laughs> then 10 other niggas are dm me in two minutes like oh yo zeddy i love your video so much that's them spreading the word right so it's exactly. like but you gain a new fan base so i just all think right. all that stuff so that's of course fan interaction right. but like the dating life like how does that go <laughs> Six million on TikTok, going up on Instagram. Look, see, you don't I ain't really gonna, publicize. For you. I don't got no, I don't got no girlfriend. But bad timing, you will fuck with myself. They I'm be gonna, wilding, like good. Nah, I, I don't be wilding. It's just when I, when I, I said travel, they be wilding. Oh, like, when I, they be wilding. As in, like, now nah, girls, girls, girls fake tweaking. do be wilding, but it's like sporadically, like it's like, like it's only when I it? travel. Like they'll post, yeah, they'll definitely post. <laughs> Yo, girls be posting, mentioning me, and, and, and saying certain crazy shit. But so like, you can't slide in no DMs. No, you're gonna. Nah, I see me, nigga, like <laughs> me. I don't, I don't care. Like, I'm a DM you, say what I never, what I need to say, because okay. I feel like I've been, I've gotten screenshotted a couple times, thrown into close friends, and it's just like, what do you want me to do? If I want you, <laughs> I'm going to try to bag you. I don't care about nothing. So you ever shot your shot at somebody that was like up there, up there? Oh yeah, absolutely. And you want to name two? <laughs> I name I name one. What's her name? Um, damn. Yeah, let's fake a couple of them. Let's fake a couple. Got it. Let's fake a couple of them. Anna, you know Anna, you know Anna, Anna Max TikTok, Instagram. Anna Max on Instagram. She's a singer. Singer. Okay. Yeah. Anna Max. She she fake up there. I did, I I joined her live, and I was just sauce on the live, <laughs> and she was like, "Oh, I'm Jackie. Where you from? You cute. You know, I'm from New York." She's like, you funny? I'm like, yeah, I'm a comedian. And I was on live. Everybody was watching it. So then uh-huh. after that, I'm like, oh, I could do this. And I just started DMing everybody. Looks like I could do this. You see how, like, on Twitch, they have, like, the E-dates and you yeah, win the girl. I want to join one of those. Yo, if anybody got E-dates, I ain't going to lie, throw me in that. So I can <laughs> win that. And I don't even need bread. I just need niggas to know that I got sauce. And you yeah, got sauce? I don't need no money. Throw me on the E-date <laughs> so I could bag any joints on there. Okay. Yeah, I need to get on the E day. That's what I need to All do. All right. Do you have like uh like who's I don't I don't know how to say it. Like who's like your type? Like who's like you in like I don't know. You know what I'm like, trying to say. Like girl wise, like what kind of like do you like low key girls, like the makeup artists, the having your own business type of girls. I like low key. I ain't gonna lie. Like, no, but don't really know. Bro, it's something about like New York and Philly girls, like okay. I don't know. 
It's just so that. keeping it close. Yeah, keeping it. You're not close into and the like, down south. And yeah, nah, not really. Like <laughs> I like hood. Like, I like fake hood girl. Not hood hood, <laughs> but like for me, like I don't want. Gotta no, have some New York aura. Yeah, you I have guess. a bonnet on on the phone with me. You could. You don't gotta have your makeup on. You could <laughs> walk around like your toes don't gotta be done for the. Like girls be that be fiending OD on the phone and all that. Like it, I don't be liking that. Low key okay. and calm. That's that's what I'm. Do you like like a goofy girl or does it? Does it, it yeah, because nah, you like, funny, so you yeah, want like, someone funny too. If you, you want to have potential to be my girl, you gotta just be goofy. But okay. if you just want to be just here for the moment, you look good and you corny. I could jack you. <laughs> like, I ain't gonna lie to you. <laughs> if you look good and you corny, I could jack you for the moment because you not no, you not going long term. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> so like, um, so who do like people like compare you to? Do you get compared often? Yeah, DC Young Fly. Okay, that's good. DC Young Fly and um, I think yeah, I think that's what he, that's the main person. Always yeah, DC Young Fly. Every comment section, everything. DC, DC Young, Young Fly. Fly. He Always. ever hit you? You hit him? Nah, I never. We never. Nah, I never work. hit him. He never hit me. Gotta work on something. I get with DC Young Fly. That's viral. Oh, and Big Win. You ever Big heard of Big Win? He a um comedian from from Maryland. He mad funny. Okay. Ever, yeah. Those two comparisons, OD. All right. Do you feel like now, because TikTok's going up, mm-hmm. everybody's, like, trying to do content now? Like, like in New York or just period? On TikTok. Like, do you just see, like, mad people just trying to... Yeah, I feel like I see a lot, of, I see a lot more comedians. But I feel like TikTok is just a wave. So, like, anybody that's just... Like, I respect anybody that's just like, oh, this shit jumping right now. Let me okay. hop on there. Like, okay. I got a business right now. I'm trying to promote it. Let me go on there and see if my shit could boom. So, okay. any content, I, I'm jacking anything. As long as it's not nothing crazy, nothing wild, okay. I, I'm jacking it. Do you feel like you can tell what's funny and who's funny? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah? Some people don't be funny to be. I'm going to lie. Some like, people don't be funny. Some people dead don't be funny. But then there's a lot of people I don't know. Like, that's not big on the main stage, but they funny. And I've been running into them. And those are the ones I DM, like, oh, I want to make a vid with you so he can get up or something like that. Okay, well, we're going to play a little game so we can see who's funny. So we're going to see, like, who got it right now? Like, who's funny right now? So first bracket, uh, we got OJ versus OMG Jackie. Who you jacking? Taking OJ. Okay. Is it that job be feeling like girls not that funny? Or, like, what is... Nah, nah, girls is girls is funny. I'm just not OD tapped in like like that. Like I know, but you know who she is. Yeah, OD. She, okay. She's funny to me, but right now it's hot, and I'm picking the OJ. It's quiet. Okay. Yeah, we don't have you on here because we knew you would have picked yourself. Yeah, nah, nah, I ain't gonna lie. I OD. Would've, I would just put an arrow straight to the middle championship. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. But let's get it. Who we got All right, next? Desi versus Just Hilarious. Desi. Okay. Damn, I feel like sound crazy not picking no girls. I'm keeping a stack. I'm never gonna lie, neither. <laughs> All right, next we got Sh- Capri versus Shiggy. Capri. Can we get some elaborations? Like, why? Like, like, Capri, because he, like, low-key original, I feel like. Yeah, and Capri, like, Capri be making, like, real-life skits to me, like, and Shiggy just be talking. Mm-hmm. You no, know, Shiggy just had a phone up and he just be talking, like, like I don't know, like. I take Capri shit more. Because I thought like, you would say Shiggy because, like, y'all both be doing, like, the face expressions. and. Oh, yeah. Shiggy do be making faces, but nah. I'm feel me? Capri, like, Capri making skits. That's, like, my thing. I love skits. Like, you like seeing quality. Okay. Yeah. Pretty V versus B. Simone. Pretty V. Okay. We're moving along to the other side now. Cleopatra versus Drewski. Cleo, oh, Cleopatra? Cleo, Cleo Trapper, my Cleo bad. Tra- I thought it was Cleopatra, I swear to God. It's that Cleo Trapper, and she's going to correct us. But it's Cleo Trapper. I'm going to go. <laughs> so you're really not going to pick a girl? I'm, you know, I, I'm going Cleo, only because, like, Cleo's funny, like. She's funnier than Juski, you think? Yo, Cleo's funny. Like, I like Juski, like Juski funny. First of all, Cleo look good. That's one. Two, Cleo is just. Like, she just, like, she not changing nothing in her comedy. She just going to talk how she talk. And look how far she got just mm-hmm. being herself. So, okay. I'm jacking it. Drewski funny, That's what's though. up. I'm taking it. That's what's up. OJ versus Desi. I'm going Desi. Okay, yeah. He is. Desi he's, just, he's just. He's up there. He's All right. Comedy. Capri versus Pretty V. 
pretty V. Mm, okay. Love how the originals made it up. We were scared that they wasn't gonna make it up. Nah, I got them. I got them. They funny. All right, Cleo Trapper versus Curvo. Curvo. Gotta go Curvo. <laughs> okay. Gotta go Curvo. <laughs> and D one Pop or Casanac. D one Pop. Hard. Oh, okay. Dion Pop. Pop is all around funny. Like, some really. He, he will post something, not nothing about him, and he'll he'll make it funny. He'll mm-hmm. post a quote and just like. Yo, the screenshots on, on Facebook. Yo, he's screenshots on Facebook. Yo, Dion Pop really just be doing random. She be trying. <laughs> so he's mad funny. All right, this is for the final, the finals right here, the finals. Why are you face like that? You feel confident about this? Yeah, OD. <laughs> I don't know who I'm going to pick the window because I already know this chip game going to be dumb hard. Desi versus V. That's crazy. They, they be making videos together. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Desi. You set yourself up. <laughs> Yo, they, they be making videos together. And Does then. She never make a video with me, though, after this? Just tell her you love her still. High effects. I love you pretty V. <laughs> <laughs> and Curvo with a D1 pop. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. You're a true New Yorker if you pick Z1 pop. But Curvo is definitely funny. I gotta go funny. Like, I don't even care about when I'm like. Nah, but. <laughs> <laughs> He's really struggling right nah, now. Nah, D1 pop. D1 pop. Oh, wow. Okay. D1 pop. Pop. Now pop the final of the final. This is like who you're crowning funny right now. <laughs> so it's Desi versus D1 Pop. I'm going Desi Banks. I ain't gonna lie. Oh, wow. Yo, Pop is really wow. comedy though. That's tough. I'm going Desi though. I ain't gonna lie. That's tough. <laughs> he, oh, he skits like he really skits like. Wow. Desi Banks Desi for the dog. Funniest in the town. Desi, Desi Banks is the funniest in the town. Zeddy will confirm that. That's a fact. That is like not what I was expecting. Who y'all thought I was gonna pick? Um, probably Curvo. Not gonna lie. Nah, that's my guy though. But I'm picking funny over my man's. Anyway. I really thought Terry was gonna last a little longer. But that yeah, was a Terry hard versus one. Curvo is just crazy to start with. <laughs> <laughs> like I'm going to Terry party in two weeks though. Like that's O D. <laughs> Maybe she won't see this. We'll just make sure. Y'all just got to block him so he don't see this. Nah, my God. That's my week. All right. So, like, um, you said that you're definitely getting into acting. Yeah. Doing the show with HBO and all that. So, how'd you go about getting, like, your partnerships and deals and stuff like that? So, I, le- I was just do all my stuff on myself, really, because I'm the, not the type. Like, I don't really, like, help. I like to say I could do my stuff by myself. But mm-hmm. once shit started really getting serious and bigger brands started hitting me up for real, then I'm like... All right, let me try to find a manager. But I wasn't gonna go find a random person. Like mm-hmm. it was, it's like I went kind of went through family. Even though okay. family be doing niggas wrong, those too. Like, yeah. But it was more like a family, and and the person I got managing me, he a great guy, and he just been taking care of me. So I made the right decision. So you mean you met your manager through family? Yeah, through family, exactly. Okay, and you recommend getting a manager? Yeah, I mean, yeah, I feel like it'll help you though. A lot of people. Can do it themselves though. I know a lot of people that are successful that do it themselves, but me, I just had to grow up and be like, I need help. Like, well, you had help. school. You I did have school. Videos. Yeah, I was in school too, and I think that was the biggest thing. Like, I'm the type. I still want to be in school and still do what I'm doing. But like, like I was telling you before, like traveling really comes into play. Like, I got to mm-hmm. start traveling for events and and bookings and all that. So mm-hmm. I want to learn how. to to be able to do my schoolwork online and okay. leave the hotel at 10 in the morning while I'm in school. Like, it's just weird stuff. So, manage just a girl. So, what's your, um, what's your um, major in school, though? So, at first, I was doing liberal arts. But now, I'm doing acting. Because I need... When I be on set, like, I <laughs> fake be lost. Like, I don't... Fake be lost, got it. Like, you got to learn stuff with the script and, and, and screening and, and okay. doing all that other stuff. So, yeah, acting is, acting is my... Major right now. So when did you change to acting? I changed recently. Yeah, recently after after I left Howard, that's when I changed. Yeah. Okay, and why'd you leave like away school? Well, what I why'd I go out there or would I come back home? Okay, why'd you go out there first and then why'd you come back? Well, I went to Howard because I was like, I always want to go HBCU. Like, 
Yeah. And and that shit is mad fun. Like being there, I could say HBCU is mad fun. And okay, co-signing HBCUs. Yeah, OD and that's Howard good. was probably the best decision of my life. I feel like that's gonna be the best college decision I ever made in my life. Like okay. if I could stay, if I was just normal Zeddy, I would definitely <laughs> be there. Straight up, I'm staying at Howard all four years. But yeah, then I had to come home because it's like you know I got to travel and stuff, and there's okay. a lot going on. But I love Howard. Okay, and college was always been important to you, or yeah, yeah, yeah. OD. Not even because of family though, just because like remember I ran track, so. I just mm-hmm. feel like I always wanted to get a scholarship to run track, and that's what I had at Howard. So it was like, yeah, I always wanted to go to college. That wasn't not going to happen for me. And then you also got a partnership with the uh, House of Hoops? Yeah, I'm with House of Hoops. Yeah, How did that happen? Home. So they just, basically, they just hit me up, and they was like, they needed me to host because they was like, he looked like he could be a good host. And I'm <laughs> like, what y'all need to host? And they was like, oh, these basketball rivalry games that we got. And I'm like, okay. all right, so where the first place y'all want me to go? It's supposed to be Texas. I'm like, oh, that's far. Like, <laughs> so like y'all gonna like y'all gonna help me get out there and y'all gonna do all this for me. This is new to me, so I'm like, oh, that's tough. And then we started doing a whole bunch of other Traveling stuff. Shit. Yeah, so that was. So it's yeah. like the TLC games, like the celebrity basketball games. Nah, it's like, like nah, it's like we go around it? and we find like the high school teams that just be playing each other, like the biggest rivalry games. Like, okay, that's basically what it's all about. So. And then we fly out and we just do what we got to do. I host the games. They give me a mic. um, And they got their cameraman. I'm just going around talking to fans. I'm like, just everything. Regular shit you do regularly? Or was that something you had to get into? Or No, that's regular. Because I was hosting, like, parties and hosting, like, little clubs and stuff like that. Like, Mm -hmm. that was regular. So Mm -hmm. this was just getting away from the grown people and really just going to more of a kid setting. More of, like, my fan base setting. So that's why the games be crazy and they know. So it helps your fan base too. Of yeah, course. yeah, it do. Yeah. That's, okay, OG. that's good. That's cool. Yeah. That's cool. All right. So being a comedian, people like, I guess, are prideful of their work, right. and like people, of course, will copy your content. Yeah. So how do you go about situations like that? If you was to saw your content copied or something, I feel like. Or have you ever seen your content copy? Yeah, I seen. I seen one person. One person did like a a, a type of video that I was doing. Um, he went out the went out the window, and I'm like, bro, it's nobody else sticking mm-hmm. half their body outside the window, <laughs> and not saying, oh, Zeddy did it. But for me, I grew out of it. He he started to get up off of it, and I'm like, whoa. Like, so that okay. make you feel away now. Hold on, time out. But then <laughs> I started to think like, fuck it, like I'm not no hater. Like if it's funny, I know I'm gonna switch this shit up sooner or later. So uh-huh. if you want to keep doing that, then go ahead. But. If he was up, he was going up, so I was jacking it. It wasn't no problem to me uh-huh. after a while. I'm like, fuck it. But, yeah, I just got my shit copied a couple times. Okay, so so how do you feel about that? Like, do you feel like, damn, I got to come up with new content, or do you feel like my shit must be funny if people copy me? Like, how yeah, do you nah, feel about that? I feel like, yeah, like, my shit must be funny. And TikTok, really, though, it's really all about trends. Like, now that I understand it more, it's like, if you start in a trend, people are going to do it. Like, mm-hmm. It's just, that's that's really what TikTok was all about, so. And that's really what it was on. Nobody was copying me on Instagram. Nobody was, you yeah. know, doing my stuff on Facebook. It was really TikTok, so. I had to just grow up and, like, understand all that shit, so. All that shit. Okay. Yeah. So, um, so if they are re, I guess, creating your jokes or whatever, do you want them to credit you? Do you want them to tag you? Do you just not want it at all? Like, nah, all right, so this is how I go about it. Like, <laughs> this is how I go about it. My fan base, the way I got I mean, uh-huh. I got my, my supporters locked in. Okay. They're going to tag you. I go straight to the comments. If I see something that it looks similar, I go straight to the comments. And I'm going to feel reassured if my fans in the comments like, oh, nah, Zeddy did it first. Okay. That's all I need. Because okay. that's more than a... For him to just con- like, tag me in the, in the caption is little for... Like, they're going to be in the comments spamming. So, that's all I really need. That made me feel okay, good. Okay, as long as they remember where it came from. Yeah, that's as long as they're cool. not bashing him or nothing like that. Or her, because some girls be doing like, they'll do like uh, K bands and stuff like that, or, <laughs> or L bands. Like, it's a couple girls that do L bands and stuff like that. So, <laughs> don't nobody getting violated. It's all just fun and like, it's just comedy, bro. Okay. But you're definitely like, I want to say, because you say you're getting into acting, you say yeah. you're doing a couple other things. Mm-hmm. So, like, what did you, what do you like want people to like know you as overall, though? I think for me, I want to be known as just the, 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 the entertainer, the, the nigga that could just entertain anybody, 
and 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 it's just funny. He's a comedian. He's just funny. That's really at the end of the day. And then I'm gonna get into acting, so I'm gonna be wanting to be known as Zeddy the actor. And, Zeddy the actor. And then you know I'm just a bunch of stuff like yeah, just entertaining. Just okay. Entertainer. Yeah. So what's the plan from now? You're definitely gonna finish school. Yeah, I'm definitely fin- gonna I'm do finish some school. couple get, shows. Get a degree. You feel like you would get into like reality TV, or you want to do more like acting shit, or I like think my whatever own, happens. I want my own show. Like if that could be the on end some goal. like Dave Chappelle type shit. Yeah, no, on some like Martin, like like okay. what's that called? Like a sitcom. You would a do sitcom? a sitcom, yeah, but you yeah. would be like different actors. Yeah, that's what I want to do. Like, O D, yes, like okay. B Zeddy, B Mark, B. Uh, Cleo, like I- I'll be mad. Different people, like it don't matter to me. Like I want to do acting in that type of way. Like, get my own show. I don't want to do no reality okay. TV show. I don't, I'm not really. I'm Tyler you. Perry kind of does that. He do. Well, yeah, he'll I mean, act as the old man. Oh yeah, he'll yeah, act yeah. as yeah, media exactly. and then yeah, him, him and Martin and, and yeah, yeah, not that many people though. Dave yeah, Chappelle. That's what I'm saying. It's not, not that, that many people. people. So I'm trying to for me. Don't tell the world. Don't tell the world all your sauce. Yeah, you right. You right. You right. You right. You right, you right, you right. <laughs> but new shit on the way. Yeah. Um, tell the people where to find you if they don't already know where to find you at. So on Instagram, for me, my old gram got hacked. My new one is the Zeddy Will. Stop tagging Zeddy Will. It's not me. It's the Zeddy Will. And my TikTok is Zeddy Will. Um, and my YouTube is Zeddy Will. So yeah, everything yeah. else is pretty much Zeddy Will. And if it's if it's something other than that, it's not me. Respectfully, <laughs> it's not me. So like you, you gonna start messing with YouTube more? Cause yeah. you was on it before. I was on it. I was and on then it. You stopped. I stopped when I went to school, cause it's like mm-hmm. no cameraman. It's hard to really record. So nobody on campus be trying to like. They they do, but like they got school. They got class. Like <laughs> yo, you can record for me at two. Nah, I got history. What you mean history? Like I need you. This is my free period. Like, but nobody's really jacking it. So okay, I just had to take a break from it. But now I'm back. Fame, I'm closer to home, so. All that YouTube, I might as well go crazy. So, like, what's the plan Scare. on YouTube? Vlogs? Skits? Vlogs. I'm going to do vlogs. That's, I, that's the type of way I want to go because people really don't, for me, people don't really know how I live my everyday life and my day is comedy. Like, everything is comedy about okay. me. So, I feel like that is content in itself. Like, you get to see skits of me on TikTok and the gram and then YouTube should really just be vlogs. Like, everyday life. And yeah. then are you going to get on the Twitch wave? Yeah, I'm on Twitch right now. Yeah, my Twitch is Zeddy World too. So, that... Twitch is going to be good for me. I'm trying to blow up on YouTube and Twitch. That's what we're really about to do. I'm telling you right here, right now, we're about to go crazy. YouTube and Twitch. For, for. YouTube and Twitch? I'm going to work that. I'm going to work that. OD. Yeah, everybody's saying Twitch is a bag. I'm not really? going to lie. Bro, Twitch is, Twitch, Twitch is good. And those is real. Those, those is fans. Like, you're going to sit and watch me watch for three, it. four hours? I'm jacking you. OD, like, <laughs> let's, let's watch some YouTube videos. Let's react and all that. Like, so, so you're going to get into reacting? Reacting and all that? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Like Suki, Kai, and all of them, they got that on lock right now. Yeah. They got that shit on lock. So somebody else gotta come up. Just keep going. Yeah, thanks for Gotta keep up, that ladder going. So you um you be connecting with other comedians? Yeah, yeah. I'm not scared to reach out and tell somebody they funny. Like, I DM you straight up. You mad funny. Okay. Yeah, DM me back. You funny too, bro. Or someone be like, Thank you. I don't know you all. I'm gonna tap in. Like that's how I be. Like I'm not scared to text nobody or Okay. What's happening with everybody? It don't matter to me. All right. Do you like? Are you into the collabs? I don't see you do a lot of collabs. Yeah, I don't. I don't really get into like collabs. Like, why? You think that gets dicey? Like, how do you feel? Like, I feel like collabs are weird because it's like you want to post it on your page, but you yeah. want to post it on your like, page. Like, who want to so post? Like, who's gonna post it? Exactly. And then like we can't both post it because it's not funny. I'm yeah, it's that. not funny. And then now we battling to see who get the most views. Like, <laughs> my shit got a mil. I only got two hundred k. But. <laughs> Collabs is tricky for me. Like I just, I just do my own shit. Like, and if okay. somebody want to be in a vid, they could be in it. But okay. I'm cool. With everybody, anybody want ever be in a vid with me? I want to do a video with me. Like I'm gonna do a video with J Live, J Live coming up, J Live okay. Chevy. Okay, um, okay, okay. People like that. Um, so yeah, V Boogie. That's He's another. funny. Yo, yo, He's V funny. Boogie is. I didn't know if he was in tune. Yo, I was no, gonna no, 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 no. I don't like, like I don't even gotta follow you to know I'm. You funny like V Boogie. Yo, is. him with the cameraman shit. Yo, V Boogie. You with the um funny. Chill, bro. Yo, chill. <laughs> oh, that trend went crazy. <laughs> that trend went crazy. I'm talking about McDonald's DMing me. <laughs> NFL teams using my stuff. Like, no, that was that was big. That Yo, was big. That, that was funny. Chill. <laughs> like, chill. 
Only New York, nah. Everybody was jacking it though. Not even only New York. Everybody. Nah, yeah, that that was funny. That was funny because it's it's mad relatable too. Exactly. Facts, facts, facts. See, she's smiling her phone right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Nah, but um, yeah. So definitely tapping. You coming on Twitch? Yeah. YouTube vlogs facts. going crazy. Hello, baby, and yeah, we're gonna tap out now. Wait, before you do it, me. Yeah.